Hey, we just made it to Andy's. Uh, this is in uh, Branson, uh, Missouri. Uh, we just got back from Silver Dollar City. Uh, we was on the way to the house and we stopped off to get a uh, concrete. And what did you get? I got a jackhammer with peaches. Well, I got the peaches down the center and I have strawberry and banana mixed. So the jackhammer part is whatever's filled in the middle. A jackhammer is the ones that got the filling in the middle. Yeah. Supposedly. So whatever's in the middle, uh, so you pick. I picked. What did you pick? The peanut butter in the middle. I think he told you yours was. With the butterscotch on top. I think that's butterscotch. I think. Let me see. Peanut butter's in the middle. Because one's blended in. Oh wow! In, look at that. And one's in the top. So. Okay. Well, I don't know which one was which, but I got one. I got peanut butter, butterscotch, and vanilla. So let's. Try it out, no bumping on this. The, the ice cream to me is nothing fancy. The ice cream part. I like it. I like it's the custard. topping. I don't think I've had custard before. This is my first time. Well, maybe that's custard. why, because it's custard. I'm allergic to custard. It's isn't custard better for you? I don't know. Oh, I'm not allergic to it. Maybe that's what I'm, I'm getting out thinking. I thought it was ice cream. It's all in your... What's the difference between ice cream and custard? It just tastes like melted ice cream to me. Custard tastes like melted ice cream. Custard has a totally different texture than ice cream to me. It's creamy. Yeah, it's very creamy. It's, it's extremely creamy. It's creamy, but it, to me it tastes like melted ice cream but look at that look at that pull oh my goodness let's do that again yes plenty plenty of stretchy pull on that <sighs> peanut butter oh there's peanut butter right there i see the chunks look at that okay custard kind of reminds me of homemade ice cream because yeah. I think when my grandma used to because have us make ice cream when you have to keep stirring, I think that was custard that we would make it. You would have is to it custard? You put all it? the I thought that ice cream you put all the, the salt in there, right? I'm talking about when you have to cook you have to cook it first. You cook ice cream? <laughs> I never you cooked never ice made cream. Homemade ice cream. I never cooked ice cream. That's we have fried to ice cook cream. It on the stove That's a southern first. thing. And fried then ice you cream? put it how you think you put it in the thing <laughs> to mix it up with the ice and the salt? Maybe I just don't remember. You then. skipped that part because you didn't want to stir it. Probably you, don't do the first want, snow. He wants to be I lazy. Just, I just know. I no. I didn't do it. My grandmother. Don't talk about my granny. No, I'm I never call her granny. You want to be lazy. Grand. And my mom. You didn't want to sit still at the stove because you couldn't stop stirring. You had to keep stirring it. So it I don't burn. even remember. I just remember the whole thing about ice. I don't even remember doing the churn thing. If you could, I know it's wooden. You know. I know it's wooden on the outside. It had wooden slats. Is that what the old fashioned ones were? The wooden slats. All I remember, you need a lot of salt. And the only thing I remember is not the first snow. You sure got a whole don't, lot of. Don't you let me talk here. I'm talking. I'm talking. You keep saying she the only thing. She cuts me off. I remember. I'm trying to tell them the whole story about what I remember of the first thing. I've always been told, do not use the first snow, like acid snow or something like that, but don't use the first snow. That's all I had to say. Thank you for letting me finish. Your turn. Now you don't want to talk. He kept saying, the only thing I remember, but he kept saying different things. The first snow. <laughs> so, the only thing think, I remember them telling me about doing it. The only thing I remembered was the, the, the salt. The only thing I remembered was the thing about what they're telling me <laughs> but i didn't anyway. know what they told me about salt i don't know what they told me about anything else i remember them telling me yeah don't do the first snow anyway we didn't use snow when we made home well then it ain't cream. ice cream it's snow cream that's what it's called snow that's cream snow cream that's something that's totally different. oh well then we're not even talking about the same thing thank you we're not even talking about the same thing people she's using the stove i said it's not snow homemade cream. ice you don't. cream you cook homemade ice cream on the I, it's stove. It's at home. It's home snow. Home you snow cook cream. You custard on the stove, and you have to keep stirring it so that it, it won't scorch because it ruins the whole thing. It ruins After it you, you cook, cook it. it, 
you put it in the ice cream maker and back in the day we would have to take turns turning the handle and you had to put the rock salt in there so it wouldn't get stuck and all of that go ahead I'm, I'm just I'm letting you talk I'm not talking over you but anyway this tastes like home like the, the custard that we would cook on the stove to make the ice cream so you make ice cream with custard. You pour all the milk and all that it's stuff. It's custard in there. or ice cream. It's, it's one or the other. How do you make custard? Can you tell me that? I don't even know nothing about well, custard. Well, then don't try to tell I thought me. This is melted ice cream. You make custard out of melted ice cream. You let ice cream sit a while. You got custard. Bam! You made it. And you can melt it on the stove. See, she she used the stove to use the ice cream from home, not snow. She made ice cream and then she melted it to make custard. That's why you melted it. You made to melt it snow. You can't even get that by outright. <laughs> get it out smooth. Smooth as eggs. <laughs> Use eggs too. Yeah. Thank you. I, see how I did what I did there? How do you like it? Pretty good? It's good to me. Good conversation? <laughs> I'm so hot. I just. Made some custard with my How ice cream. How did your nasty smelling custard taste? It's good. Has a lot of filling in this melted ice cream. He got an old folks custard. He got butterscotch and peanut butter. Is butterscotch is the part that's making old? It's not peanut butter? I don't know. It just sounds old It's a partial all the way Elvis. It's a partial Elvis. I should put a banana in there too. Huh? What is that? Okay. Banana and peanut butter. You got me? Yeah. On the same page? I guess. If you have an Andy's frozen custard near you, try it out. Try it's it out. very good. I recommend going. It is good. It's creamy. And this was they it's a tourist trap it's a tourist town. So this is eighteen dollars for both of these. Nine a piece. Yes, just blew my stack. They don't skimp on the fruit. No, when we paid it for it, did I even? I didn't blink an eye. Well, I probably blinked, but I didn't say oh, oh. I didn't. <laughs> you see, y'all still hearing about it. I didn't do that. I just paid for it. Because this is a, a, a little trip, and I'm not worried about. It. I am kind of worried now. I don't want to say I'm not worried about it. Unless you go by, oh, you're not worried about it. Let's I convinced him crab. to do a review because we don't have an Andy's frozen custard near us anywhere. No, so. it's probably ice cream. It's not melted. Andy's. What's Andy's? A mint. Andy's. I think that's spelled a different way. Is that is that Andy's though? That's I E S. It is, but it's spelled I E S. Okay, well, never gonna sit at a National BB Gun Museum or a dinosaur museum. Let me ask now, if you. That's why the dinosaurs is extinct. The BB Gun Museum's next to the dinosaurs. Help me, please. I put two and two together. Is there anything else you want to say before we shut this off for these fine folks? No, it's not. I got a lot of fruit. A lot you of fruit. I don't get full off of these as much fruit as they put in. That's really, it's getting rich right now. It's getting Did rich. Do you want to taste mine? It's a family show. Do you want to taste some of this? Uh-uh. No? I'll taste some. Let me get you a little there bit. There is melted ice thing. cream. That's refreshing. Yes, it is. Refreshing. That's healthy. It tastes healthy. I ain't saying it is healthy. It tastes healthy. It tastes like old. I got all of like some of my favorite mixtures. Like I said, I got peaches, strawberries, and bananas. 
and they give you big chunks of big chunks of strawberries and peaches and I had the bananas blended in okay now we're gonna eat ribs and chicken chicken and ribs yep my dad and stepmom's cooking so we're gonna do that not gonna tell him about the dessert he cooked for me this morning but he had to recook mine oh, oh she almost she almost up chucked <clears throat> No, she, I didn't. You should have saw her face when she pressed it. It looked like a waterbed. Yeah. It she was. pressed the egg and she goes, <laughs> She doesn't do runny eggs. And my dad made a egg in a hole. So you have to watch the video of vlog 328. To see what that is. It's, it's day four. Day, let me look right now. I'm going to tell you right now. It's right here on this vlog sd card vlog 329 day three day three so i was saying day four okay vlog 329 day three so uh check that out in the beginning and breakfast um and egg in a hole but it was it was pretty good it was simple my dad cooked simple so you'll see his uh I think, I don't know if he told the recipe, but it's like three ingredients to his salsa. Simple salsa, Gary Simple Salsa. He says you can add apples, anything else to it that you want, anything you want to it, but you can't call it Gary Simple Salsa because it's not simple anymore. Okay, other than that, he is did it, say that. Yes, anything else you want to say? No. I said it all. Okay, well, thank you very much, guys. I'm going to jump off of this. Uh, this uh, video and I will talk to you on the next food review. Go post stop recording. Hey, Andy's. I got a medium and a large. Yeah, I got the large and I can't even uh, show you like this. This and this is the same size. Look at that, same size. I got ripped off, folks. But I'm not going back. It's a big, long line. Yes, I got screwed in the drive-thru. Don't ever go up to the drive-thru. They do at the drive-thru, okay? But it is $18.25 altogether. I think the tax here, tourist tax is like $6 of that. Like, probably 33%. Um, but, uh, mine was like supposed to be seven something and hers was like maybe five something or six. So, plus the tax but uh yes it was good and i'm not gonna run back and get my little my tummy my tummy's hurt because i didn't get my large but maybe they gave me two larges maybe that's two larges and we came out ahead but that i don't know i just had to say that because i was frustrated okay now i gotta go over and out hope you liked the review had a rant a little bit now i feel better so thank you for listening Go post stop recording. Hey, thanks for watching the video again. If you haven't visited my website yet, um, the, the address is www.dougarbagedisposalstore.com. You can navigate through the top, all these links right here. Um, there is actually a question and comment form. If you have any questions or comments, uh, fill that out and it'll go straight to my email. At the very bottom, there is a free newsletter. Just sign up for right here um, and you will get a weekly newsletter. So, uh, if you haven't subscribed to the channel, what are you waiting on? Hit the subscribe button, hit the notification bell, hit see all so you get all the notifications and don't miss the videos. Please comment. I like to um, listen to your comments uh, and respond to you. So I do like to interact with you guys. Uh, please share the video with your friends, family, even your boss. And have a great day. Let's meet other plans.